Hey y'all, this is Brittany with Roasted Coffee Co. And today we are going to be talking about coffee trailers. So y'all, I ultimately decided to get a trailer because when I would attend these farmer's markets and all these different events, of course I would bring my samples with me and people would literally be offering to buy the samples. And I'm like, no, they're free, you know, they're samples. So, you know, you don't have to buy, they're free. I've had, um, at the last event that I did, I brought a lady a coffee mug. We were both vendors. Y'all, she filled up that entire coffee mug <laughs> and was sipping on my coffee throughout our entire event. And I'm like, you know what? I should probably, I really need to pursue this because now what I'm noticing is that people, they want something to drink right then and there. They do not necessarily want the beans and grounds unless they're into you know making their own coffee and all that good stuff but I started looking for trailers right now you see me searching on Pinterest and man coffee trailers can get expensive um I've seen the lowest I want to say maybe about 8,000 and that's only because the seller is ready to hurry up and just get rid of it to the highest which can go I think the highest I've seen is maybe 45,000 and that is for the you know the little horse trailers that you that you see everybody else doing so I was like I honestly everything that I do is out of pocket I don't want to take out any loans any debt credit card all that good stuff try or bad stuff <laughs> trying to um make this happen so I was like what you know what can I do to kind of you know bring my coffee trailer to life and I really considered just buying a really ran down um, trailer off of maybe Facebook marketplace and trying to rehab it myself um, but it was just going to take way too much work and I don't have a lot of knowledge in regards to tools so I was like hmm what can I do? Hmm. Let me think. Let me think. Let me think. Let me put my put my thinking cap on and figure out what I can do. And I headed over to Alibaba, which you see me actually scrolling right here. And um, I was just looking at different trailers, uh, coffee supplies, things like that. Now, I had a previous business where I done a lot of business on this app. So I know how to, I kind of know the ins and outs, the things to look for, um, how to communicate, language barriers, all that good stuff. And I just kept scrolling and scrolling and scrolling, trying to find um, something that I liked. And I, I, I love the look of the horse trailer, but everybody is doing the horse trailer. So I definitely wanted something a little bit different from what everybody else was doing. And so honestly, I just got on here and got to scrolling and just started reaching out to a bunch of different, um, a bunch of different businesses and just took it from there. And I did end up settling upon a business, which we're going to get into, um, in a little bit. And I'll kind of let y'all know what that process was. But so far, honestly, it's been a really smooth process, communication on point, questions answered, um, all that good stuff. So go on here the app again is alibaba you can just download it from your play store or your uh, whatever the apple store is and y'all they have everything on here everything and so this is going to be my biggest purchase off of here but i mean i've heard of people making even bigger purchases <laughs> off of this app and then of course um with the shipping, it is shipped to you via the ocean, via the seas. So anyways, ultimately, I ended up settling upon this um, trailer right here, which mine is going to be black. It's going to have roasting on it, but this is directly from my um, business that I'm working with, and they're called Hennen We Care. So the first name is Hennen, which is H E. N A N, and then the last name We Care, uh, which you see spelled out right there. But this is just a little video that they sent me, and this is how mine is going to look, except it is going to be black. And then when you get into the inside, you can customize how you want the inside to look. And so I actually went ahead and just sent them uh, 
the regulations from my health department. Luckily, they do business out here in Houston already. So they were very familiar with the requirements, but I sent them anyways. And here is what I'm working with. So I have my three compartment sink, a hand washing sink, and then where it says no counter here, that's where I'm going to be placing a little mini fridge. And then the rest of it is counter space. Um, and then underneath the counters, I have like open space so I can place items there as well and my trailer is going to be $4,200 they did require a 50% deposit so I paid $2,100 uh, for the deposit and then I have $1,700 that I have to pay once it's complete but this is pretty much how it's going to look again except it's going to be in black and I'm really excited I I'm excited, but I'm also nervous because I really would have liked to stick with, you know, a builder here, but I don't have 18, 20, you know, 50 K to shell out and taking out a loan for that amount of money is absolutely a no go. My only bills is my house, car payment and utilities. I don't need any extra stuff. <laughs> so my plan is to just operate my trailer on the weekends because I still have my nine to five job. But I know that um, eventually I'll be able to go full time. Well, I'm hoping I'll be able to go full time. And I think it's going to pay off itself fairly quickly. So um, now I am trying to think about all the supplies that I need to get. And you're about to see me scrolling endlessly on Amazon. So I'm looking at espresso machines, um, frothers, lights, uh, all kind of different things, measuring cups, griddles, generators, all that good stuff. Um, I am going to do a more in-depth video about the trailer because I really wanted to make sure that they understand or understood me or what I was trying to say. <laughs> so, um, definitely going to do another video on it because although it was it's been a very easy process you want to make sure that everything in your trailer is Americanized so plugs your outlets uh, sinks uh, all that good stuff the wiring all of that and um, yeah so that's pretty much it for now so this was just a little intro video into the trailer that I am buying off of an app from China. So we will see how it goes. Um, I am anticipating it be here maybe about mid June. It takes about 30, 35, 40 days. So they're, I know they're in the process of building it now. So we're looking at about mid June. And yeah, if you guys have any questions, please let me know. And uh, yeah, have a good day. Talk to you later. Bye.